Og så guys. Eh. Uh, we have a different video. This is um a hard one to do. Mental health affects everybody in different ways. Men, women, children, elderly, all ages. No matter who you are, what you are, how rich or poor you are. Mental health is something you should look after as well as physical health. This as well as this. And people don't talk about it enough. And that's the truth in matter of fact. People don't know how to deal with it. And things happen to those that are not in a good place. The biggest killer of men under the age of 40 in the UK is suicide. And in the 21st century, that's wrong. A lot of the time, you know, you're going back years and years ago and still to this day. If people were to get a man up, grow some balls, sort yourself out. It's wrong. You'd be struggling to talk about it. Taking your life isn't the right thing to do. Trying to solve the problem by drinking, taking illegal drugs, hurting yourself isn't the right thing to do. Talk to someone. Voice what's going on. Talk to your mates, talk to talk to anybody, talk to someone. I um recently stopped a man from jumping off a bridge. And somebody doing that eating. You don't really think about it. Um, and then you see it happening. And then when you start to process it after what's happened. When you read into more stuff what's going on. It's, it's shocking. You know. Even after that happened, there's been a few more news articles recently where people have taken the lives by jumping off the bridge, by doing other things, and a lot of it can be traced back to mental health. They feel like all they have left is to take their own lives, and that's not the answer. And just a simple conversation probably would have helped. So, anybody, not just guys, but guys in particular, don't be stubborn. Don't be silent. Talk to anybody, to somebody. People will listen, people will help. Go out there and just get the help you need. And people. Even if you don't feel down, everybody's affected by mental health in some way. Whether it's yourself, whether it's friends, family, work colleagues, club members, people you game with, you know. Even your favourite YouTubers in the world, self-mental health. person that stands out to me most is Boogie. 
um, he struggles. And his way of coping is YouTube. That's great, but he also has people he can talk to. But there are YouTubes out there who have taken their lives. Get help. That's what I'm saying. Rich, poor. No matter your circumstance, get help. Taking life isn't the answer. Take care, guys.